This has run long enough. I think I think we can say with certainty that uh, that it's not going to get much lower than this. 107.8, 107.9, uh, maybe in a hundred cycles it might drop down to 105. I think it's time to start cooling the uh, to start cooling the hydrogen. That's going to be our solution. Uh, I think I think you're right. I think we will once we get the this room nice and cool. We'll seal this room off, insulated uh, across the top, and then or in a door, of course, and then we'll start uh, pumping in hydrogen here as well and we'll get all that carbon dioxide out of there do you have the wart seeds yes i do i want to do one two three four these guys right here i was gonna take those and just dedicate them this was just a test to see if it would work here and it does by keeping it from overheating even though but oh but it wasn't a threat of overheating can you do the same small closed cooling system with the cooling machine from the ice biome uh i could i could close this off for sure especially now i mean honestly especially now that it's 100 degrees in here now would be a time to do it for sure um we already have the mechanisms in place so we have hydrogen that's already feeding to vents so once we seal this off this would, that would probably be a better way of using that keeping that nice and cool we could do that now there's, there's nothing no harm in sealing this off right now and making that happen let me see because otherwise it's not gonna it's not gonna get any warmer or colder rather let me see what do we have so let's go up here. And then... What is the... Oh, that's those. Oh, there's an electrolyzer right there. So we'll go down right here. Oh, I can't. Okay. Um, should I go around the electrolyzer? Yeah, we will for now. And then we'll leave that there. So we'll probably kill that electrolyzer. Because I don't think it's really doing anything. I don't think it has been doing anything for a while. We have plenty of hydrogen going this way to feed the machine. So this will be a way just to get that going. Yeah, someone's gonna get stuck over there. I can already see this happening. <laughs> yeah, we'll see if it, it takes so long to heat up or to cool down. I can't imagine, like, it's just getting forever. How are we doing over here? So we haven't done anything with it. We still have not done the analysis. Why, Aaron's, Lindsay's unreachable. Lindsay says unreachable. Oh, I grounded Lindsay from, um... Oh, never mind. Where's Lindsay going? How's unreachable? No. No. What? That's the second time I've seen a dupe do this. I ignored it the first time. That's the second time. What is wrong with this? Okay, this whole area is shit. Why are we focused on that? <laughs> that one square. Just, what did it do? And why is she not going out here? She has access. I didn't lock anybody out. Hold on a second. Where is she at? Come here, Lindsay. She's my scientist, man. I need her to do stuff. Let's see, move to... Oh, you know what? It's probably unreachable because she can't... Ah, okay. There's not enough exposed to do it. Let's do this then. She could dig, I think. Maybe not. <laughs> this one she could probably do. Oh, wait. Maybe can she? Uh, unreachable again. So I guess they need to have more of it exposed. Yeah. Is this unreachable? Ah, okay, there we go. So now now it's on her list. The chlorine gas vent's on her list. So this one is still unreachable, though. They could get across here, obviously, because they cut this out. I wonder if I should just cut another one? Just cut another... As long as the top is covered, I think it's fine. Not allowed by schedule. Well, hold on a second. If I cancel this and then cancel, oops, cancel. Not allowed by schedule. Okay, okay. So she can do that one. She's just not right now because she's sleeping. How's this guy doing? What's the? Wow, it's really dense with hydrogen right now. That's uh, that's good. That's very good. Do I want to? They can't squeeze in around the top. So I guess I'll have to cut a hole up top and with all this. Oh god damn! It. Well, you know what? No, I'll get them. I'll give them. Uh, I don't want them to pierce this and get this oxygen out of here. That'll just be a pain in the dick to clean up. So we'll just do that. And that should be enough to let them reach. Uh, there we go. 
And then there's this little corner. Oh, okay, no, that's uh, not something to build. They're building right now. So that means you don't need to do that either. Oh, there's uh, a conveyor right there. Oh, it's where we gotta get the conveyor going too. Which we get to start. Oh, never mind. We just split it off of this. Oh, I forgot about the conveyor system. So we'll go up. Is there anything else we need? No, I think that's good. And they should be able to do the rest from these two podiums once they get those built. And then we can move the wheeze warts over and all that. And then actually, we'll go ahead and do that now. So we'll go ahead and uh, uh, uproot. 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 What up, warm water? <laughs> Speaking of. <laughs> Speaking of warm water. Uh, what's the point? What's the point of the door to the hydrogen room? Well, now, I guess nothing, because it's wide open. Uh, but before it was so we could pressurize the room with just hydrogen, and we could, we could uh, control the, uh, the, the heat exchange that goes through there. Now, yeah, now it's not that big of a deal. So we could probably go ahead and uh, actually deconstruct that. Oh, no, 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 no. Now it still is a big deal because there's more heat in here right now. Well, it was. Let's seal it off, because that's just more volume that we'd have to, uh, to heat. And I don't want to have to fuck with that. So we're going to seal it off. There we go. Yeah, I don't want that heat escaping. Or, in this case now, I don't want... I don't want it to, uh, uh, be more space that I'm going to have to cool. Once this, once this area gets, like, ice cold, which is not going to happen, but let's just assume, let's pretend that this area gets crazy chill. Then, then we'll look into um, uh, uh, maybe expanding it out and cooling this entire area here. If we could get this entire basement looking like this, can you imagine? Can you imagine? I'll be like an oxygen not included wizard. It's the best. Oh, you know, I put that uh, valve in, but I didn't adjust it. So let's go ahead and start that now. Because, yeah, it's that's th thick. So we'll make this uh, 2,000. Gritter report, 80,000 to go. Well, uh, you know what? I don't think the ear is coming back anymore. I think he banned himself, so... We're gonna have to find someone else to put on that list. Who's that gonna be? Or what else can we put on there to make... What's 100,000... What's 100,000 girders worth to you guys? <sighs> make me the chosen one. Ah, oh, man, I don't know. That's a, that's a, that's a big... That's a tall order. Look at all these fives. Look at all these fives! <sighs> Whatever got done with fives. Seal that out though, please. I'll do it. Top. Top, I think people like you. <laughs> Ear is not here to get the joke. Uh, hurry up, get up there, seal it off. Okay, let's make things let's speed things up, because I really I really want to get some of these jobs done. I have too many pending jobs that are not complete. Fertilizer, give it. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Body temperature. I was afraid it was going to happen. Uh, I think I said specifically, too, didn't I say before that this is where, this is the warmer side? I wonder if it's because of what's in here. Yeah, no, not really. So, how about we take, this one's not doing a job. Like, this is just not working out. This whole, this whole room actually can suck a dick. I'm so tired of it. <laughs> I'm so tired of it. Uh, kids, don't repeat what I say. Then we'll put a wart seed there. I knew that this side, this corner was going to be the problem. I should have left one there. Okay, go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. We can get this started. Put one here. Put one here. We need the, the ladders in the way of the other ones, though. They got banned daily in another Discord. <laughs> you too? <laughs> So that's a weird humble brag. Oh, I got pipes here that need to go away. Hold on a second. These. That's a no. Cancel that. And get rid of that. Actually, uh, you don't need any of this. Up here. Oh. Can they still reach this? Unreachable build, that one. Uh, I think one more ladder will do the trick. Probably don't need it, but at the heat exchange to uh, there, now it's reachable. Ooh, actually, wait, is it only reachable because... No, 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 no. Oh, it's reachable. Yeah, wait. Oh, get it. Get the top one. Top one. Top one. Top one first. 
Oh, good, it still works. Wait, does that mean they can do this little hole right here? Let me see. Uh, P9. Whoops. Dang it. Eight. Oh, cool, they can. I know they can reach around corners, but I swear sometimes they just can't. But the good news is they don't need this. And we can also get rid of uh, this, 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 and... Uh-oh, don't go anywhere, Donis. Don't go anywhere, Donis! Put a wheeze worth there. Oh, I need power. <laughs> oh, of course. Need power, too. God. Shit don't work for free. <laughs> well, those wires are in place. Uh, unnecessarily. We'll go ahead and get rid of those. And we'll just leave that one at the top, I guess. <laughs> Alright, give me another wart. So we're going to let this cook for a bit. Before we seal it up. Or we actually, we will seal it up. Um, and then we're going to let it cook. Clean this stuff up. After we clean things up. This is not working right now because of max gas pressure. This is negative 76, 6, 73 point something uh, in the room hydrogen. God, maybe we can just like cool all of the hydrogen in here just with this little tiny room. It runs off of imagination. I'll just keep mixing negative pH with total Africa and Darude sandstorm. <laughs> That's funny. What's up with this oxygen, guys? Is it? It's probably seeping in from over here. Is that a mechanical door that's powered? Mechanized airlock sure is, so it's closing almost immediately. So we have a ton of oxygen we need to get rid of in order for this whole system to, to work, of like cooling. So when we do put a pump in, I think we're probably going to put it at the bottom right here and just let it just push, push everything out. But we're going to junk or split? I don't know. Or we'll, we'll uh, push the oxygen through the system. We'll put a split in here. Oxygen and hydrogen split. That way, um, we'll push the oxygen down through here, or merge it with this. And then we will come on, stop freezing, goddammit. Thank you. That'll be the beginning of the process uh, of, of the that'll be the first steps towards Recycling the oxygen we currently have instead of trying to create more using the electrolyzer. That's what I'm trying to say. How's this doing? Cool. Wow, God, it's so cold so fast. 64 degrees already. Uh, let's go ahead and seal it up. Make sure everything else is good. It's paying the dick to get in there and make any changes. Good. Good. You missed nudes! Cookies! You missed it! Must have been short news. It was actually a full length news, but we started early because it was just we just covered the rest of the uh, Warcraft 3 news that had come out. Good. Good. Nice and cool. Now we'll wait for that. We'll, we'll wait for that to get like super, super cool. Then we'll start running stuff through it. So, let's build a split. Somewhere in here we have to build a split. So it's gonna come through here. Uh, let's see... Ventilation... Should we use... Automation? I feel like automation misses sometimes. Which is not that... Bad, actually. Yeah, if it misses here, like, none of these are going to vital pieces of machinery, so it's fine if a little bit of oxygen or hydrogen gets mixed up between the two. So... We will put in a... a gas... Mm, is it the... Gas valve gas... gas sh automatically... Uh, automation grid. Yeah, that's what I want. Okay. So, we'll put it... This is going to be the main pipe coming in. So that will be... Oh, we got, we got a new uh, thing. So that'll be here. And then we'll put the... Oh, there's power right there. So I think it runs off power, so that's fine. Gas pipe element sensor. We'll put that there. And then we're going to put a wire between the two. Wow, they're building it fast. <laughs> and then we're going <laughs> to... Hurry up, hurry up and build it! Then we're going to go ahead and connect it with uh, some more of this. So this is going to go down here. And we'll just merge this in, I guess just uh, kind of willy-nilly like that, and that should be fine. Exit's good, good. And this is going to be, whenever it senses oxygen, then it does a split. No, uh, yeah, oxygen. Oxygen. It splits. No gas output, they'll get it. That's an easy split. 
Yeah, maybe, maybe we could ease up on the usage of this uh, of this over here, the electrolyzer, pipe electrolyzer, which uses 480 degrees. Weez work by comparison. And can only cool. Oh wow, so the AETN gets really low. Speaking of, did they ever finish that project over there? They sure did. I wonder if this is doing anything for it. Not yet, but probably because of this nonsense. So let's go and get this pipe electrolyzer, get the thing deconstructed as quickly as possible. Then we're gonna put a door right there to keep that keep this area nice and safe. What do we have for power down here? The power right there. We'll just run that one more wire over. And we'll put it in a nice fast door to keep this room nice and toy, like a toyga. Come on, there we go. No? What else is here? Oh, it's a fucking bridge. <sighs> we don't need the bridge right now, obviously. You can see this. So we will kill the bridge too. Gather fast. <laughs> and then we'll just run liquid pipe. And maybe what we'll do is we're gonna let's let's insulate this these pipes that are currently in here. That way we give it an opportunity to start cooling on its own and not flooding it, right? There we go. And then even these will probably go ahead and swap out. And then mechanize mechanize. What is in the way here? What am I missing? Three, four, five. Oh, there's a, there's a, the damn temp shift plate. Temp shift plate's blocking it. How much time do you put into prep for news? I feel like it must be a fair bit. It is, it is. Uh, I mean, today was easy. It took me only like two hours, I think, to do. Last week, it took me like five hours to put the notes together for the news. But yeah, today was easy because it was a bunch of stuff that I had already been following. Um, but more importantly, it was all on one game, so it was really easy to pull everything up. All right, so that should be good in terms of, uh, let's see, this should probably go, deconstruct that. Probably should, I mean, we're not really getting a whole lot of hydrogen feeding through this, so I don't have to worry about that. As long as everything is, for the most part, insulated. Insulated, oh, except that little piece right there. Oh, they're getting it still. Then we should start to see this room cool. Should, should. He wings it. If there's anything else, local chat is here to help. That's right, that's true, that's very true. Okay, so that should, uh, take its sweet time. We'll come back to that later. How are we doing with this room? Ooh, let's get that nice, deep, bluish green. So sexy. What is it? Mm, 38 degrees. We're getting there. This is, uh, negative 74.5. Oh, actually, are they shutting off? Hold on, hold on, hold on. They sure are. This is my favorite part. Where they get so cold that they actually take turns like cooling the rest of them to keep them below negative 76 point whatever degrees. So what does this mean? It means if we pump in any oxygen that is below 150 degrees, it's gonna be like, it's gonna, well first off 150 degrees comes out at like 80 or 90 degrees. So if we bring in something that is, you know, 90 degrees, it's gonna be, there's gonna be some icy, icy air coming out of this thing. Let's 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 finish this build up. I'm excited. This is gonna be a great like this. This should be a this this should be a great thing that we're doing here. I don't know, man. I'm a little worried. Uh, should I go straight up and just pierce through that? They can reach it. That's gonna be the uh, output. What would put it through there? That's uh, oh, that's hydrogen actually. So the hydrogen's gonna have to come back into the room. Should we? Well, first let's worry about getting it in there. And so that's the in. There's the sensor. So we're going to grab this from what? Oh, I think I said I was going to put it down here. So we'll put a gas pump here. Or maybe not right there. That's kind of a bad spot. Up a little, like up one more. Just kind of keep it floating. Oh, what is this? Oh, look at that. There's an announcement there. Oh. Uh, from Clay. They must know I'm streaming. Let's see. Gas pump. Blam. Up one tile. Give it more room to breathe. And actually, we don't need... Oh, yeah, we do. Give it a second to think. Did you get it replaced? Yeah, I did. I Well, I told it to, but I'll go back. I'll go back and check in a second. And then we'll do a gas bridge. In and out. Uh, oh, I messed up the direction of... Oh, no, I didn't. 
I almost did. So that'll get it into the system. Now getting it out, I think we should probably take it and run it to the other side. This is the uh, hydrogen side. And so this is gonna go, we'll just do this. Whoops, maybe we'll leave it up actually. And we'll just bring it all the way over here. And we'll just have a drop off, like just down. See, I see we have some excess here that's not needed anymore. So we could go ahead and uh, we'll keep that one, but we'll snip this in between here. Oh, actually, that has to be snipped too. Damn it. So we'll snip that. Uh, and we'll. Damn it. Get rid of that, that. Make sure that gets gone. Get rid of those pieces. What big pipes you have. I know. And then we'll put, build another one next to it. And we'll just start, we'll just eject it all down here, basically. Or maybe we'll do it right there, actually. Yeah, you know, that's fine. We'll put it right there. Right there. We'll just, uh, do we have enough plastic? We need to go turn on the, uh, <laughs> the polymer press. <laughs> and babysit it. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I have enough. I have enough. I have enough. We're good. There. That should be enough to push it all over. Because the, the pump is down here. And it's not plugged in. Uh, oh, none of this is plugged in. We might as well go ahead and plug this bitch up with heavy wire. <laughs> no, we won't do that. Oh. There we go. So, let's see. Lots dense. Real dense with oxygen. Um, pull all that through. I mean, we, we're real dense with hydrogen, too, but I think we just have a lot of oxygen. So, we'll take all this oxygen out at 110 degrees. So, it's a lot cooler than what's coming out of the electrolyzer. So, that's, that's the exciting part, is that we're going to get a really good amount of cooling on this oxygen that's already kind of cool. How's this doing? Make sure my my hoses are correct here. See, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And that's gonna go up and over. And that's gonna go over here. Okay, that's easy. Good. Done. These. Look at them eventually. I'm waiting for it to blow too. I I have been waiting as well. Like I, I I strongly feel like we are pushing it, but somehow, somehow. I mean, like think about it. We just attach another pump to the same line, but at the same time. This pump and this electrolyzer is, they're not operating. It is a piped electrolyzer. So that's a fair amount of electricity, 480 and 240 that we're not uh, using for anything else. That we're, not, that we're not using right now. So I think we keep on not, I, th I think we, we continue to not blow circuits because we keep on sacrificing things to make other things work, which I mean, we could talk about whether or not it's a good or a bad thing. I don't know. Um, let me see. That pump goes to this vent right here, but we don't really need it right now. We actually we should just leave this room alone, as is. But I really want to see this thing work. The white line in between the oxy and hydro. The white line. Do you mean like the, the hydro here and the oxy here, or what? It's so it's so hard to find some of these things that you guys talk about. <laughs> Come on, hurry up. Oh, those pipes, the pipes are getting done. Okay, good. Cable's good. Here comes oxygen. Boop, boop, bloop, 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 bloop. That's what I want to see. It goes in at what? 110 degrees and it comes out at what? Negative 41 degrees! But that's gonna change because it's gonna heat up the room. But Jesus, yeah, neg it's already it's already look, it's already warmed up. Negative 26 degrees. It's already nice and toasty now, guys. <laughs> so if you use the gases. The white line. You mean this? That's carbon dioxide. Between the oh, this right here. That's just it's. It, it looks weird because uh of the the uh, the temp shift plates. Temp shift plates make it difficult to see gases sometimes, depending on like how dense the gas is. But yeah, that's that's all that is. It looks like a white line, but all it is is just where the hydrogen and the uh, uh and the uh, oxygen meet. I love that color scheme though. So how are we doing over here? Let's see. So it's coming through. It's coming out. Negative twenty three degrees. Uh, oh, actually, we weren't getting oxygen for the base for a minute there. Wow, we're like really low on um, on oxygen. How funny! How quickly! How quickly we run out of uh, of air. <laughs> we're not even pumping it out of here, man. Where is it all going? Up. 
All right. Well, we're feeding it now. We're feeding it. Uh, I feel like quite a lot. So, and it's cold air too. Like that's ice cold air. Look at the green around this. They're gonna start bitching about how cold it is. Here it comes. Here it comes. The complaints are gonna start. Oh, look, we have air. Oh, but it's so chilly. Sand. Give me sand. Breathing extra hard. I know. If you accidentally vent that gas and everything starts turning on at once, you'll blow every fuse in the whole asteroid. If I accidentally. Vent, yes, yes. If I accidentally do all those things. Oh, look, they can't get down here because uh, they weren't getting gas or getting uh, oxygen. This will solve the problem. But I do feel like this. Oh, no, that's still going. That's still going. So we're basically feeding this entire base from what? From a gas pump and an electrolyzer. So this is not going to last. We're going to have to turn this on eventually. But just not right now. We have all of this oxygen in here. We have tons of oxygen to go through. Like, there's no shortage of that. How's this room doing? Ooh, it's green! It's starting to, uh, it's starting to, to work. So, hey, if this thing gets down to negative, whatever we said earlier, negative 170 degrees Fahrenheit, and whatever that is in Celsius, um, then super. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes. Good. But it'll take forever to get there, I think. Maybe those, uh, Bristol Blossom will finally know their place. I know. Sticks. Body temperature, 87.9. This over here is getting kind of warm too. Oh, that's fertilization. Body temperatures. It's warm up here. Yeah. We just gotta get these uh get these vents going. It's gonna take it a while, but it will uh it'll cool off. And actually, you know what? We should probably go ahead and this was just this was good for like a minute, but I think we're kinda over this. I'd rather have like raw, delicious gas. With oxygen. Not not cool floors. <laughs> It was a good experiment while well, it lasted. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Why are you backed up here, guy? Is something not complete? It goes in here, out there, in here, out there. Ah. Because they can't get down here, that's why. I gotta make a couple changes. We just gotta get all this stuff in there. Negative two, well, who's even worse? <laughs> oh my God, negative 279.67 degrees Fahrenheit. That's wild. What the hell? Very tight mic accidentally stuff came out. Nope, not this time. Must've been thinking about someone else. You imagine them suffocating up here? Went down here, it's like rich. <laughs> like super rich, like 7,000. It's crazy. How's this doing? Oh. Is that chlorine? Oh my god. We opened it up enough to start working. Can they can she do an analysis? Unreachable. Okay. Uh so the chlorine gas vent is operable. Let's go ahead and just seal it up real quick. Okay, we'll do this. <laughs> and then we'll uh Yeah. It's not a lot, but it's something. All right, so the suits have plenty of oxygen coming to them. This has stopped because, oh, because we're not getting a whole lot of oxygen. So now it's time to turn back. Now it's time to turn all this stuff back on. So now we're going to blow a circuit. All right, this is our this is our moment here. So we're going to go ahead and we'll just make this, was it 1,000? So that's going to turn on right away. And then we're going to, and this will just start working in a second that enough uh, pressure frees up. There we go. This is still held up because these are not done yet. So once this is done, then this system's gonna, this system will, will flourish. How crazy, there's even gas down here. God, look at this nasty, nasty, nasty. Gross. Hey, it is an easy fix. We just put on a, um, let's put a giant one down here. Do I have like a, uh, enough room for a giant one? Not really. What she said. Let's put down. One tile. Actually, no, we'll do this. Put it right in the middle. Airflow tile would go one, two. Then we're gonna grab, it was on our oxygen. 
deodorizer, super air filter. That'll take care of all problems. Is that one down there? I mean, look at this. Look at the germs. Nope. Clean. Totally clean. Super clean. This water's still coming out of here. Probably backed up. Pipe blocked. Yep, because we slowed down. The, we trickled it out, which was smart. These need to happen, though, guys. Otherwise, our system's not gonna work. Just gonna sit in there and get ice fucking cold. Wow, look at look at the green everywhere. It's still not enough. Like we still don't have enough oxygen to scale like for a building this size for a base this size. But I think once we get it, yeah, once we do get it up and you know, uh full of uh full of rich oxygen, we can start pumping oxygen from other places and also start cycling it on itself. So those are number of things we could do. Temperature-wise, we're mostly fine, though. Food supplies are dwindling. Why? Is that because... Boots, no penny deliveries. Okay, hold on. We're at 62,000. Let's just slow it down a little bit. We have a variety of food. I mean, he's he's grilling. Boots is grilling. I wonder if I should just take Boots off of everything else and just tell him to grill. Or just lower everything else. Whoops. Let's see. Ske not schedule. Priorities. Boots. Boots is a cook. And really not much else of anything. Let me, uh, or not much of anything else. Supplying. Storing. Tidying. Hopefully that's good. Also can't breathe over here. Oh yeah, because of the oxygen. Yeah, that's fine. They'll be fine. Hmm. Grill master boots. That's right. How fitting too. When he came, he came down to uh, uh, SF, and we went to um, one of my favorite, one of my favorite joints. Barbecue joints. He said it was better than anything he's ever had in Texas. I was like, word. Huh, Boots? You still here? To back me up on that? Alright. We'll have to keep an eye on those food supplies. <laughs> Don't let his neighbors hear you say Texas barbecue card revoked. Good small barbecue places. Oh, yeah. Let me see. Slicks or larva? Ice. Take the ice. Okay, so oxygen supply is being replenished. The, uh, this is gonna get really cold by the time this is built. Wow. Uh-oh. Uh... Insufficient resources. Incorrect. That's not right. Igneous rock? I'm just, how, are we out of igneous rock? Uh, what is that under? Miscellaneous manufacturing material, edible seed. Critical, so raw mineral, I'm guessing. Igneous rock. Zero. And that's, I mean, there's a, there's 72.2 tons of granite, so it's not like it's behind something. I guess we're actually just out of igneous rock. I'll build it with something else then. I'm a little surprised. Well. I guess if you build everything out of igneous rock, eventually it's going to catch up to you. Oop, that's regular gas pipe. Let me see. Do, 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 do. Make it out of granite. Which we have 72 tons of. Room's getting colder. I really want to see how quickly we could cool this room. Like, I feel like this is going to be a pretty significant thing. And then once we cool this room, then I'll, I'll be able to put any machine I want in here, really. Like... Aqua tuners or, or uh, 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 yeah, well, really anything I want, I could put in here. It's as long as the room stays packed with hydrogen and we can get it down low enough, like, you know, keeping it cool. Um, yeah, this would be freaking great. Just can't, we just can't move unless we get 
These last pipes done. 61, 63. I want to see that. That thing should keep going, man. I, I'm a little worried. Last one. Here it is. And then our basement cooling system is in place. Here it comes. 95 degree hydrogen. Okay, that's not what I wanted. But the, oh, here it goes. Negative, 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 negative. There we go. We should be able to see a blast of cool blue coming out of here. Okay, well, maybe it'll take it a minute. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, it's still 112, 112, hydrogen 112, 112. God, how long does it take for it to actually take place? Oh, there's none in here. Oh, because we're thinning it out now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's thinning out until we get, well, we'll get there, we'll get there. It's, it's just gotta get, just gotta get all this uh, pesky oxygen out of here. What is this? Polluted oxygen, what is that doing down here? How do we get to that? Well, I don't know. And then there's this guy. We're waiting. What is it waiting for? Just sand, right? Yeah. Keep that thing full. Polluted. Oh, we got a lot of polluted water in this. Oh, that's right. We did just bypass everything and drop it in here for the for processing. Yeah, that's fine. I know. I was like really heavily against that last episode. I didn't want to uh, mix the dirty water with this, but. I'm on, I'm on the verge of putting a fucking pump in there. <laughs> Just put a damn pump in there. We're getting good good blasts of cold. The cold-ish. I mean, it's 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 now it's it's kind of uh, it looks like it's stabilizing 34 degrees to 60, 70. I mean, I would say it's probably average about 50 something degrees, 50 degrees. Um, this room is. I mean, this room is still chill, so like we don't have to really worry about that. And it's going to continue to get colder. Um, my experiment that I did with this with these four setups is almost exact same setup here. Uh, it was electrolyzer going straight through it. And actually, you know what? Like the, here it is. Like this right here. Like, this is electrolyzer going through at 157 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, like, that's pretty hot. And it still will continue to maintain a uh, an incredible amount of coolness. How's AATN? Yes, check it. You know what this game needs? I don't know if it has it, but you guys don't know how to do it. I haven't figured it out yet. But uh, it needs, like, you know, StarCraft, you could, like, put, like, different areas on hotkeys. So you just go boom, 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 and just kind of fly around the map. I need that. Let me see, we're at 57 degrees, which is good. How funny, it's like getting cooler down here too? Why? Was it always green down here? Or is this thing, oh wait, what is this tile made of? Obsidian, okay, that's, I mean, that tile's cool, but I don't remember what the state of this tile was. Yeah, it's just regular tile. So it's just transferring. Well, that's fine. I mean, if it ends up cooling down here, it's not gonna hurt anything. Uh, it'll take it longer to uh, to cool. Can I replace it? I wonder if I can replace it. I know that sometimes these like these non dupe created tiles. Yeah, you can't you can't replace them. But at the very least, I can replace these two. Oh, that'll help. Oh, you know what I can do? One, two, three, four. Oh yeah, I'll just do this. Oops, just wait a second. It's cooling everything. I know. It's cooling all my machines down there. But they don't need it though. There we go. Mmm, they won't be able to reach that. That's fine. Can they reach that one? Maybe. Oh, look at those hot-ass resources. <laughs> Pull those out of the depth of hell and brought them over here to put them in. 112 degrees. I can also reach- I know, but the last time I did that, what happened? I'm afraid I might break this damn machine if I tried that. Get it, get it, get it. How we doing uh, down here, by the way? Got it blocked off, fantastic. Is it leaking out or is it, it should be overpressurized, I would think, but I'll have to assume that it's, uh, yeah, that's not the case. Uh, no, it's, it's definitely still working. If that doesn't do it, then I don't know if I, uh, <laughs> I don't know. There we go. We'll just give it a nice big insulator hug. There. One little gap. We'll live. How funny we can't deconstruct these things. Cancel deconstruct. Yeah, it's not gonna work. So now we should see it get uh, much colder, much faster. 
instead of trying to cool the entire everything. I mean, this door is probably not helping either. It's not made out of aluminum. Isn't aluminum pretty conductive? So yeah, that's gonna probably leak some as well. Can they make like an insulated door? Ah, oh wait, actually over here too. Damn. Over here it's transferring heat. Well, let's let's see if the top bottom is enough for now, and then if we have to come back and, and build a couple more uh, insulated tiles around it, then we will. But I think right now it's probably okay. Speaking of cooling things off, oh, look at that. 50 degrees, 50 degrees. 50 degrees is good. 50 degrees is good. Oh, we got some carbon dioxide made in the mix. Which means we're getting down to the bottom of... Uh, now there's some oxygen around. Control plus number to save camera. Like shift number to go to... That doesn't really work, does it? That's exactly that's, that's exactly how StarCraft works, isn't it? Hold on. Control one. Oh, <gasps> they made a sound. Why didn't I fucking know about this, man? Rob, where were you? Four hundred and ninety-five hours ago. Thank you, Rob. We got a problem, by the way. Our suits aren't filling up. Yeah, everything has changed. Okay, so then, uh, yeah, we'll fill food. So shift one, good. Let's say, I mean, let's just say this is uh, this biome over here. This is gonna be control two. Oh man, Rob deserves a dupe. <laughs> yeah, Rob deserves a dupe. Uh, Rob, man, changing my life. Uh, what was it? I came over here to look at. Yes, I, I'm, I'm not getting oxygen for some reason, so that means something is backed up. This is backed up. What's that? Because that is backed up too. Uh, we need to recompress or dump. Is this uh, the room is getting pretty full too? So I think we're gonna we need to move. We don't need this going in here. It's got plenty of gas in there. And also we're, we're leaching into this anyways with this vent. So that's plenty. So we need to get this thing moving because that that's backed up, which means the electrolyzer is not pumping any oxygen out. And that's the reason why those suits don't get oxygen. So <sighs> there's always something. There's always something. Let me see. We'll grab all this. And then instead we're going to grab the see ventilation. We're going to draw all this stuff out before we uh, commit to getting these guys. Oh, actually, mm, see it comes out there and we'll have, yeah, we'll just go straight over here and then we'll just have it come up and just dump off. I mean, basically wherever, just have it just dump off in here and it'll push his way up. <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. You know what? Fuck it. Let's put it right here. Oh, and I have a high pressure vent. Shit, I gotta wait for it. Okay. Just to alleviate the pressure, though, I think I could do this. Nope, because there's nowhere for it to go. So as soon as they're done taking that thing off, wait, actually, let's go and prioritize that high. Deconstruct, uh, cancel, but also deconstruct like it right now. Buildings. Good. Then we'll put it up. Yep, we got plastic now. There we go. It was pumping in this room. He has to come in later because he always late to the party. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's look at it. Gonna do that. So once that thing is built, <clears throat> that's gonna free up this entire line here. We've already got some of it freed up, so we're getting more oxygen now, just about a tiny little bit that we just freed up there. Uh, but we need to get it. We need more. So we'll dump all the excess ox hydrogen into the room. Which means this room is gonna become, become like crazy pressurized with hydrogen. Meanwhile, camera's just one. Oh, shift one. There we go. Shift two. Uh oh. Shift two. Stupid thing there. All these old pipes, we have to redo all those. But yeah, oxygen's flowing. That's all we need. How come that is not, uh... No, wait, cancel that, cancel that. Because this should be... What is it because of this setup here, with the way that this is um, hooked in? You didn't snip that pipe underneath the AETN. I, I, well, I meant to. Um, how about I do this?
There we go. Problem solved. It's rickety, but it works. Uh, I think the temp shifts over the drains leach temp from the ATN. Oh, over here, huh? Yeah, I think you're right. There's a gap right there, but still, it reaches out beyond that. So, yeah, you're right. Let's go and blow those up. They're only there. They're only there for initially. We were testing the way that we were expanding the um, the space using uh, using temperature plates to kind of spread the love across the pipe. And I think it worked, but you know, it's like whatever now. Once this thing gets low enough, we have some ice. We could probably make a couple of ice temp shift plates. Which will be cool. Speaking of, it's at 50 degrees right now. So we'll come back and check on that later. And this room is going to get packed. Look at the hydrogen. You can see the hydrogen shoving its way out. Just shoving its way out another. And this room has got how much hydrogen is? This is way, way, way enough. Okay, how are we doing down here? There, now it's done. This chlorine should eventually all go out. Might want to open this cavern up a little bit more. Like here. Let's do those two. That'll get rid of a huge chunk there. And then we can do this. And then that. That'll open things up a bit. And we'll take care of whatever mess it makes later. One, two. And... Oh! We're okay, we'll be... There. That'll help empty out the room. And get it uh, turned into a vacuum, and then we can do whatever we want with it. Whoa! Look at that! We're getting really low here! Wow, magically. Hiccups. <laughs> That's what it was. He had the hiccups. <laughs> That's exactly what it was, too. <laughs> He's like, well, hold on a second. <laughs> All right, coming out. There it is 48 degrees. That's nice. Coming out over here, 43 degrees. Also nice. Good, good. Base has got oxygen. Still does. It's low. I mean, it's not low, but it's still not great. Oh, hi, Donut. Did you bring a toy in here? No, we can't play right now. We can't play right now. I gotta do it. I'm doing work. No, 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 Donut. No. I do it anyways. <sighs> He's like, it's playtime. I threw it. <laughs> I did throw it. <laughs> Play a little fetch for a second. You know, I, you know, I have an automated ball launcher. It was a gift. And uh, he doesn't like the fan. Yeah, hi. Ready? Come here. Mm -mm. There's plenty of room on that side of the studio, though. So I could just throw it over the thing. I had a man we played. It's been decreed. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's exactly it. 